Hello everybody, welcome back to another video and in this video I'm going to be showing you how to get the Minecraft preview game on Windows 10 and 11 of course. And so if you like Minecraft videos like this one then please make sure you leave a like and subscribe to the channel for more Minecraft tutorials and other Minecraft videos. And so not too long ago, Mojang announced Minecraft Preview, which in the long term will replace the Bedrock Beta program and will be the place to check out the new Minecraft updates before they get added to the final game on Minecraft Bedrock Edition. It is currently available on iOS, Xbox and Windows 10 slash 11, but will be available to other platforms soon as well. And so if you want to know how to get Minecraft Preview on any other devices, then just check out the link to the FAQ I put in the description down below. There you can find all the steps for all the different consoles but today i'll be going through the process of installing minecraft preview and i will also show you how to get out of the bedrock beta program so you can get this back to a normal minecraft bedrock edition version and this will mean that you can access both the normal minecraft bedrock edition version to play on regularly and you also get minecraft preview on which you can test out and check out the new features for for example minecraft 1.19 the wild update which yes you can see the beautiful features right around me here with the frogs and the frog lights so it's super useful and if you play on the bedrock beta i would recommend to switch over to preview because of course in long term also the beta program will be discontinued and so it's nice to have already switched there and it's of course also really helpful to be able to play Minecraft Bedrock Edition without having to opt in and out of the beta every single time and so i'll get started with leaving the beta so this is actually quite easy so what you need to do is just well, leave the game. Then you want to go over to the Xbox Insider Hub. So this is also where you opted into the Barrack Beta. So just go to the Xbox Insider Hub right here. Then here you can head over to Previews. And then here you see that we have joined the Barrack Beta program. We can click on that one. And here we can manage it. So we can go to manage and we can leave the preview. That's this button over here, leave preview. And so you can see that you have to uninstall and reinstall Minecraft to be able to play the non-beta versions of the game. So we can click continue and it's loading or pending here. And there we go. Now we've left the bedrock beta as it says, you might need to reinstall the game. And we can do so by just going over to apps and features. So that's this one over here and then in the list you can search for minecraft make sure it is the better condition version that's this one over here with the square grass block the other ones are the minecraft launcher and minecraft java edition so make sure you have the right one and then you can uninstall here uninstall yes also be aware that you won't be able to save any of your worlds you had in the beta all right, now it has uninstalled. Now we can reinstall Minecraft Better Condition by heading over to the Microsoft Store and searching for Minecraft for Windows. So that is this one right over here, Minecraft for Windows. And here we can then install the game again. And so this will then be the non-beta version of the game since we've opted out of the beta program. All right, there we go, it has installed. Now we can press play and we'll see that it will launch the normal Minecraft Better Condition game. And so then you also have to re-log in. For some reason it's in Dutch, but there we go. Let's just log in with our Microsoft account. All right, and there we go. We are back in the game and we can see we're no longer in the beta. This is just Minecraft 1.18.1 or 10 in this case. You might also have to reapply your skin here in the dressing room. And let's also change the language back to English. It automatically changes it back to your original language. There we go. Beautiful. So, okay, that's done. Now we can go and download Minecraft Preview. Of course, you could have done this before as well, but then you would have beta and preview at the same time, which would be basically the same. So now we'll have one of both. So as for Minecraft preview, I will leave a link in the description down below to the Microsoft store page where you can download it. For some reason, you will not be able to find it in here just yet. It's called Minecraft preview for Windows, but it just doesn't show up just yet currently. It might show up for you when you watch this video later, but for now, just use the link I have in the description down below. And so this will be the top link in the description. And as you can see, it automatically brings you to Minecraft preview for Windows. And so this will be free if you have a version of Minecraft Bedrock Edition already linked to this Microsoft account. And so since I have that, I can immediately install it. If you don't, you will first have to buy Minecraft Bedrock Edition on this Microsoft account before you can get the Minecraft preview. And so what we can do is just click install. It's really easy. We'll just download it right here. Also, there is no limit on how many people can get Minecraft preview on Windows. 
This is different on iOS. There are only a few people can get Minecraft Preview initially and it might roll out to more people in the future. But for Windows, everyone who has a copy of Minecraft Better Edition will be able to get Minecraft Preview for Windows for free. And there we go, it has installed and now we can click play. And this will be Minecraft Preview as it says at the top left here. And we'll see something similar as with the normal Minecraft Better Edition, where it defaults to Dutch in this case, and all the other settings like music and FOV and all other kinds of settings have been reset to the default values. And also here now it says Minecraft Preview, so that works just fine. And instead of beta 1.8.20.26, it now says preview 1.18.20.26. And it has all the same information as the beta would also have. So just log in with your Microsoft account, it will most likely give you a pop-up like this. And then we can just click on let's play, or you might need to log in yourself as well. And then here we go, we're in Minecraft preview. Let's quickly change the language again to English, all right. And let's also put our skin here as well. So I just use a skin from here. And then we choose this one, that's the correct one, I believe. And we can go back and there we go. So now we can play in the Minecraft preview and here we also have the normal Minecraft Battle Condition at the same time opened as well. And so then here we also see that we don't have any worlds here, so none of the worlds of the beta or of the normal Minecraft Battle Condition will come over to the Minecraft preview. So you have to create a new world here instead of playing on your old worlds. So yeah, that is Minecraft preview. I think it's pretty much it. We can test it out and see if it works, create a new world. We also have the new UI here we can try out, so let's try that one. Not. There we go, beautiful UI. Ah, that's a little bit of a problem. There is no experimental modes are not in this new UI just yet. So let's go back to the old UI then. They'll probably add that in a future preview though. There we go, here are the experiments in the old UI. So we can check out the wild update. And there's some more experiments here as well. You can of course search up what these experiments are, but one I think most people are after is the wild update experiment. And we can create the world. And here we see indeed Minecraft preview, new logo, all right. But furthermore, it acts pretty much the same as the Battle Beta, apart from it being a completely separate game now. So there we go, we're now in a Minecraft preview world, and we should be able to get some frogs. There we go, frogs are here, and there should also be skulk. Frogs, frogs, beautiful. And yes, we also have all the different skulk blocks right here. And so there we go, that is how to get Minecraft preview on Windows 10. As I said, if you want to know how to do this on other consoles, I'll leave a link to the FAQ down in the description down below. If you have any further questions, those should probably be answered there as well. And so if you like this video, then please make sure you leave a like and subscribe to the channel for more micro videos like this one. I want to thank my tier 3 member, the Smigglar. Thank you for becoming a tier 3 member. If you also become a member, click the blue join button below the video to check out the different tiers. But there we go. I hope you all enjoyed the episode in the next one. So until then, bye bye. Thank <laughs> you.